Johnny Fairplay for RealityGeek.com. We're talking Survivor, Nicaragua. I got Eliza, one of the greatest players I think ever. She, she plays a little crazy. <laughs> I mean, let, let, let's be honest. It's true. All right. But so, what do you think about Nicaragua? Um, thought it was, you know, a, a tough first episode. Like yeah. to get to know people, it was like very much Jimmy Johnson focused and being the, you know, Redskins and Giants fans that we are. Fuck the evil empire, right? Yeah. Well, it, my, 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 my problem with, with the episode, like, I don't, I, I think every premiere should be 90 minutes has or two to be, hours. It has to be. You can't get to know anyone. It's so, I mean, like, I, we, 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 we played uh, fans versus favorites together. And, uh, and and the fact that we lost the first challenge and, 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 and went to uh, Tribal Council, it, it wasn't until episode three when you, when you even learned the first fan's name. Right. So, uh, like, it, you know, I, I, I just disagree with the whole, you know, 60 minute premiere, and especially if there's someone with, with the personality of a Jimmy Johnson that's going right. to steal all the attention. I mean, fans were favorites. I stole all the attention on that. I mean, like, I, I, I thought it was too much. For one episode. No, I, I thought I stole too much. I, like, I love me. And I thought it was too much Johnny Fairplay. I mean, honestly, you know, I, I, I've only watched the episode once. But, alright, so, we have a new deal called the, uh, uh, the Medallion of Power. Oh, it's such an embarrassing name. It's just such a terrible name. It sounds like it's like straight out of, you know, video game. Dungeons and Dragons. The Medallion of Power. It's like embarrassing when Jeff it, it, says it. it it's kind of Warcraft-ish. Yes. <laughs> number one. And number two, uh, I like Survivor. And I like Big Brother. You don't need to bring Big Brother into Survivor. <laughs> there, there, there's a reason that they're two different shows. I mean, you know, obviously, Survivor's so much better than Big Brother. Obviously. Oh, who's this being filmed by? <laughs> that would be Rachel from Big Brother. <laughs> Thanks, Johnny. Yes. I mean, but, you know, but, you know, vastly superior Survivor. I mean, so, so what do you think of the Medallion of Power, other than the horrible name? Garbage? I think it's pretty stupid. I mean, first of all, would you, would you have pushed to use it in the first challenge? Because I certainly would have, especially my first time on the show. These are all new people. They're like, oh, we don't need to use it. We're going to beat them anyhow. No, you're not. You're the old people. Yeah, you're the old use people. Use it, and then that means someone on your tribe isn't the first person being voted off. Like, I think there's nothing worse than being first out. And, and do, you, do you think it's a little set up for Jimmy Johnson to, to, to do pretty good? I mean, like, like the Medallion of Power, it's just like, you can have all this fishing stuff. And all these great things, or this thing that you don't even know what it does, you know, so that they give right. to Jimmy Johnson. Right, exactly. And, and we, we, we the girl who found it, that girl Brenda, who climbed up the tree and found it, I love her. I think she might be my favorite this season. She's, she's my like favorite. the new Harvey, like Wait, the new... Whoa, hey, hey. Well, she's like... She's Wait, a mix. I, thought, I thought we were friends. She's, she's a mix <laughs> between me and Harvey, people will say. But oh, she's, okay. she's got the smarts, but she's also got the, like, flirting and everything else. Yeah, why didn't you flirt with me out there? I, I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, you didn't win. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, so, so, real quick, I, and, and we, can, we can speak frankly here, because, you know, I... I, I mean, you'll never be on another Survivor, but I will. And so that I, I have much more to lose here. <laughs> so, uh, Jimmy Johnson's speech, you know, there's no way I can win. You know, I, I'm just here to coach you to the end. You know, I, that's what I'm here for. Did Lynn Spillman, head of casting, give him those? Was she holding the cue cards? <laughs> <laughs> they might have talked about it ahead of time, but I mean, his speech, he's right. He's right. Who wouldn't want to take Jimmy Johnson to the end? I would. Jimmy Johnson. Plus, then Jimmy Johnson would be your friend. I'd be like, I want to go to the Giants Dallas game. I want to go to a lot of games. So, uh, all right. Well, I, I think this has been kind of insightful, right? Yeah. Absolutely. And you're cute. Thanks. So we got Earl, winner, Survivor Fiji, and uh, we're talking a little Survivor Nicaragua. Like, uh, what do you think of the premiere? Uh, I thought it was a good premiere, but I think. The uh, under 30 has more of an advantage. Not because of the. Um, not Fabio. No. Not Fabio. Not Fabio. No. And the two muscle heads. I'm not really impressed yeah. with them. I don't know. I think I think they're playing a role right now. Yeah. It's all strategy. I know you are all about strategy. <laughs> I, 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 I think they, they, they told the Miami Dolphins trailer way too much information. And, and, and they're two. Hey, I had two meatheads on Pro Islands Burton and Sean. The yeah. first person I sent out was Burton. That, oh, that was that was smart. But I think I think we got a lot of honest players, right? 
go ahead. <laughs> well, you're the most honest player ever. Well, no, I am. Yeah. Yeah. Of so, course. I, like, it's got to be better than this last season of Big Brother. I mean, like they all want, they want to be go, go be friends. Are there a show called Big Brother? It's on the internet. Oh, okay. Not on TV. Oh, yeah. Oh, by the way, this is being filmed by Rachel. From, from, from Thanks, Johnny. Yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. I love Big Brother. No, is it on CBS? It is on CBS. You sure? I think, I think it's on my network. It's on the CW. CW? <laughs> it's on the WB. Yeah. It's on the WB. It's on BET, actually. Wow. Oh, Yo, you weren't geez. ready for that one. I was not ready for that. And, and amazingly, there's a lot of white people. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. All right, so what do you think about Jimmy Johnson? Um, I don't know everybody wants to put him as his leader because he, you know, was he a coach? Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. I know that, but I don't know. I don't think he's going to do that well. Well, I, I, all right, I, the, the, the commercial's he's old. Go, the commercial's don't go going this to you. I mean, he might kick my ass. But. No, the commercial's going into the premiere. Looked like he was kind of kicking ass. And then we watch the episode, he's throwing up, and he's yeah. dying. Yeah, <laughs> he's falling apart at the scene. He's making football to, look bad. To, making football look bad. So it was the worst 24 hours of his life. Oh <laughs> I did enjoy that, because a lot of people don't know how hard it is. It's hard. It, it is very hard. Very hard. Uh, you know. So, so it should be a good season? It's going to be a great season. Who's your money on? My money is on Sash. Sash? Wow. I'm going Dolphins cheerleading. I don't know her name yet. There's a joke in there about money on a Dolphins cheerleading, but I'm going to bring it up. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> Next time on ReallyGeek.com.